Well, Dustin Carr was only police chief in Millersville for 116 days. He resigned abruptly this past Monday following controversy that now seems to include a graphic picture exposing himself while in uniform. Andy Cordan went to Millersville to look into this story and joins us with the latest. Yeah, you know, Dustin Carr was a Millersville cop for 10 years. I've worked with him countless times on many police stories. Now, when he resigned, it kind of came out of left field. He told me that he was uh, tired of little town politics. He wanted to spend more time with his family, and he was taking a job in the private sector. At 1.42 Monday morning, Millersville City Manager Scott Avery tells me, Police Chief Dustin Carr sent him a text that abruptly stated that Dustin Carr was resigning as the Millersville Police Chief, a post that Carr had only held since April 7th. By week's end, a graphic picture of Dustin Carr emerges, and it's shared across the Internet. News 2 has seen the picture. It's not appropriate for television. But it shows Carr wearing his police uniform, his badge, and his gun. And he's exposing himself while standing in front of a mirror. It's unclear when the picture is taken or how it was disseminated. I can't really talk about how I learned about the picture, but... Uh, but you have seen it. I have. I've seen it twice now, and I've never had possession of it. It's never been given to me. No formal complaint was ever filed with me, which is what the law requires. According to the city manager, had Carr still been the police chief when he learned of this lurid picture, Scott Avery tells me that he would have taken decisive action. There would have been immediate uh, administrative leave. An investigation would have been started. If the picture was validated and verified, I would have terminated the employee. Um, you know, technically, I guess I could still investigate it, but why are we going to spend man hours investigating something that no longer is relevant? Because on the surface, I do not see a crime right. which requires us to investigate. And the violations of the personnel rules no longer apply because he's not an employee as of Sunday night. In a statement, Dustin Carr tells News 2, the photograph in question was taken privately. It was shared illegally without my consent in order to harm me and my family. I want the citizens of Millersville to know that throughout my entire career, I always took pride in performing my duties with great honor and integrity. I'm thankful for the opportunity to have been able to serve the Millersville community. Following my voluntary resignation, I'm excited to have the opportunity to spend more time with my supportive wife and children as I pursue a new career in the private sector. I'm unable to make further comments at this time. Now, while Dustin Carr says the image was shared illegally, the city says no crime's been committed, and at this time they have no plans to investigate the incident. Back to you guys. All right, Andy, so the big question is where does Millersville go from here? Andy learned the city has hired an interim police chief. Lifelong officer Melvin Brown worked for decades with the Metro Nashville Police Department, and he was an investigator with the Alcoholic Beverage Commission as well. Well, the city leaders say Brown brings a new energy to the force. He's not working today because he's going to work Saturday evening with the officers, with the people out on the street. How, how many police chiefs would do that? And this guy's just an interim. In his fourth day, he's going to be out on the street working with the patrolmen, making sure they have all the tools they need to do their job and making sure that, that everything out there is working for the best for this community. While Brown is interim, Avery says they'll open the position to applicants nationwide.